Hello people, it is me, Porky2007, so welcome back to another Cars Diecast review. And remember from my last review, where I said I'll review this? Well, this is the, well, this is the video. Now, like, at first it may just say Mac Holler, but today we are reviewing the Cars 2 slash Hudson Hornet Piston Cup Mac Holler. I got this for $20 at Walmart, and oh my god. They use Cars 1 Lightning McQueen instead of using Hudson Hornet Piston Cup Lightning McQueen. Now look. Now look, this is the only Mac in my collection. And I know some of y'all might be I know some of y'all might be saying like, oh what about the Mac that was in your stop motion? Your car stop motion. Well, I actually well that's actually my brother's and I borrowed that. But but now I have my own, which is a lumber cooler. Why? Because when this hauler was first released, um, like you know, back in 2011, it was like it was a rare item, and now um, it's been re-released. And I mean, yeah, it's not rare anymore, but but still, though, I have a I have an item that once was rare, so that's nice and cool to have. And it's another Cars 2 um, diecast, which, like what I said from the other review, I I hate Cars 2, but like what I said, the merchandise is awesome. So yeah, let's open this baby with my X-Acto knife. Now look, before I do this, um, I don't have a Hudson Hornet Piston Cup Lightning McQueen. Instead, I'll be using the, the World Grand Prix slash Racing Tires slash Cars 2 Lightning McQueen because, well, I mean... Both of them appeared in Cars 2. But um yeah, let's 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 open. There's an easy open at the back. Not back under. Alrighty, we are back from opening this item, which by the way I have to Stabbed through the packaging just to get him out, but yeah, um, we have the item open and now let's and now let's review it. Let's start off with the semi itself, which is Mac. God, it's hard to open. Is there something under him too that I have to open? No. Ah, come on, you little. Oh, I don't want to break it. I. This is hard to open. Excuse me for a second. I have to do this off camera or not during recording. Meanwhile, already I'm back from um, trying to separate Mac and the trailer, which was very difficult because it took a while and um, it, it, it had a very tight connection. All right, let's just take a look at Mac. So, um, Mac, um, I mean, he's good. He looks good. I mean, that mouth plate, his hat doesn't really match the color of the diecast, but it's, it's not really that noticeable. Got his headlights. We got his his um his blinker lights, I guess. And um, we got um his grill. We got Mac on the grill and Mac on the side. We got the 95 with with the lightning with the lightning bolt. I'm striking through the 95 because that's what the Hudson Hornet Lightning McQueen has. Has mirrors. Got a hat, which by the way, I didn't notice that the hat had these lightning bolts like you know on the sides of the Rusty's logo we got um we got um the lights on top of him i mean um i mean on camera it i mean on camera doesn't really look that noticeable but in but in person yeah the yeah the colors of the hat and uh the mouth plate slash bumper are sort of noticeable over here we got these back things which i think these are um, exhaust pipes. Um, I'm not that much of a car person. I'm not. I'm not really a car person. I mean, I. Don't, I mean, I mean, yeah, I like Pixar's cars, but I don't really know all the car parts. So yeah, we got a bunch of a bunch of stuff at the back. More detailing. Got the Rusty's flaps, and we got his license plate, which has Rusty's three. And we got the hole at the bottom, just so you can attach this to the trailer, which I'm not going to because I don't want to um, get another tight connection. 
So we got so we got the trailer. It has McQueen on it. We got Rusty's. We got 95. We got the Hudson Hornet Piston Cup logo. We got this that says Rusty's proud sponsor team of Lightning McQueen. And we got his secondary sponsors, which should I really name them? I mean, I guess they should. Gasparin, Tank Coat, Shiny Wax, Transparent Juice, Toe Cap, Shifty Drug, Revolting, Leakless, Retread, Octane Gang, Violin, Easy Idle, No Stall, Gaskets, Mood Springs, Nitro Raid, Little Twerky Pistons, and RPM. Yeah, I had to name all of them. Alright, so we got this. We got this. Um, I don't know what this is. Same printing at the side, but I guess mirrored, but they're not really mirrored because if it was mirrored, it, it, um, it, these words would probably be in. These words would also be mirrored, but basically the same design, but but different. And over at the back, we got um, McQueen himself. We got Rusty's Hudson Hornet Piston Cup, and we got 95. And we got a little design for the lightning bolt. And we have the license plate, which says, wait, Rusty's 4. Oh, oh, wait, wait. I think I know. Rusty's 3, Rusty's 4. Yeah, 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 I think I get it. Now. I, thought, I thought that was like some kind of error, but I guess not. And now let's open the hauler. Yeah, the front door opens. Um, Mac is the only hauler that that the door actually opens. Now let's slide this out. Let's bring down this to hold it. And now let's grab our Cars 2 Lightning McQueen because I don't have a Hudson Hornet Lightning McQueen. I hope they re-release him soon. And now um, let's just um, let's just close this. And now let's put um let's close it. Now let's um now let's try to open it. Now let's put Lady McQueen out. Yeah, pretty nice um pretty nice feature. Now let's look under him, which is just a bunch of plastic made in Vietnam. The hollow is made in Vietnam. The actual die cast wait also made in Vietnam. Huh. Interesting. I thought these were made in Thailand, but I guess they're made. I, I, I guess that explains the the weird um the weird um dif the color difference between um the hat and the actual paint. I mean, like what I said, it's not that noticeable on camera, but in real life, it yeah it yeah that doesn't really look good. <laughs> but um yeah, let's just put it back on. Hopefully, um no tight connection. Okay, not a tight connection anymore. So yeah, um, ooh, that makes a squeaky sound. I do not like that. Let's just, I don't know why it's making that squeaky sound, but um, but um, yeah, that is a review. Wait, what do I think of it? It is a awesome, awesome Mac caller. I mean, like, I mean, like, when this thing was originally released, this thing was like rare. But now, since because this thing has been re-released, um, now it's not so rare anymore. But hey, at least I got an item that once was rare. And um, I really do like the design of the hauler. And I even I didn't even know that um, there were these lightning bolts at his hat. I thought it was just a Rusty's logo. But um, yeah, um, yeah, pretty cool hauler. The only issue that I have is that um, the hat and the mouth plate are completely different shades of colors. I mean, it makes sense. It's made in Vietnam, not in Thailand for some reason. I mean, I mean, is it that noticeable in the eyes? Hold up. Thailand eyes are like, are like, um, they have this, they have this eye plate while in Vietnam is have printed eyes and they're fuzzy. I mean, is that noticeable? I mean, they're, I mean, they're clear. They're not like really, really fuzzy, unlike many other Vietnam cars. And the decals are actually pretty good, unlike Vietnam cars. Alrighty, so yeah, that is it for the review, and um, I hope we get a re-release of of Hudson Hornet, Lightning McQueen, because well, I don't have them, and this would go well. Anywho, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe and and don't forget to join the Red Axel Hollow Discord server by using the link in the description. And goodbye. And by the way
boulders.